request Honorable Minister Dr. Tony Booty to please come up onto the stage to speak a few words. May I also request ISPA Secretary Mr. Deepak Sharma to accompany him onto the stage. The Honorable Dr. Tony Booty is Western Australia's Minister for Finance, Racing and Gaming, Aboriginal Affairs, Citizenship and Multicultural Interests. He has been a minister for the McGowan government since March 2021 and has been the member for Armadale in the Legislative Assembly since 2010. Namaste. It's great to be here and could I commend by acknowledging that we are meeting in this convention centre which is in Watjart country and pay respects to their elders past, present and emerging. Well it's fantastic to be celebrating India's 75th anniversary but it seems to be this anniversary seems to be celebrated over a couple of years so I'm sure that you're enjoying every part of it and it's great to be here at this annual Sangam event. As the Premier said, we really do value the diversity, the culturally and linguistic and religious diversity of Western Australia and the Indian population plays a major part of that. There are many dignitaries here tonight. Um, I'm not 100% sure who is here on the list, so I'm just going to say I acknowledge all my state and federal parliamentary colleagues. And I do know, I think there's only one local, par uh, local member of parliament, uh, local government member, and that is uh, the Right Honourable uh, Lord Mayor of Perth, uh, Basil Sempelis. But as I said, every other parliamentarian here, I, uh, pay, uh, I acknowledge you. And can I particularly acknowledge my Indian colleagues in state parliament, uh, Kevin Michelle, uh, my parliamentary secretary, Yaz Mubarakai, and unfortunately Dr Jags um, is not very well, Dr Jags Krishna. I think he needs to go and find himself a good, a good doctor to look after himself because he's um, quite sick. So I hope he's well enough to come back to Parliament next week. I've got a little story about Kevin Michelle, though, who's the, um, who's, uh, the member for the Pilbara. We were up in um, Karatha uh, last week or the week before, and he invited the Labor caucus around to his house for a dinner. And as you realise, the Labor caucus is very large. His cooking abilities are just amazing, absolutely amazing. So, Kevin, thank you very much for all your hospitality. And if you ever do decide to leave Parliament, um, you, I'm sure you'll make an outstanding chef. And uh, Kevin was part of our, Italian, our, our Indian delegation that went to India quite recently, a very large delegation from Western Australia led by the Deputy Premier Roger Cook and the Minister for International Students, uh, David Templeman, went along, and Kevin and Yaz and uh, Dr Jags also went with them. I am told that the, uh, the Indian uh, politicians and business people were incredibly impressed that we had three members of state parliament uh, from India. So I think they are doing a great job in representing uh, the Indian population back in India and also a great representative of their local community. The diversity in, in, our, in our parliament is replicated in the, um, in the uh, federal parliament and there's two acquisitions of the recent election in Sam and Sunita, who are both, um, uh, I, don't, I don't think Sunita's here today, but San Lim, uh, uh, so it's great to have you here. And Sunita is the member for Swan. So they both come from diverse cultural backgrounds, so it's fantastic to have them here. But look, all the dancers here, all the music here, it attests to the diversity in the Indian population. And it's just always colourful, it's always bright, it's always enthusiastic. The Indian communities of Western Australia are such an important part of our social and economic fabric. And part of the reason that uh, the WA government led a delegation to India is that we very much value the social, cultural and economic ties between our local Indian communities and the uh, Indian uh, communities and governments of, uh, of subcontinental India. 
So thank you for being such an important part of our community in Western Australia. And just before I do leave you, I do. Uh, I, I am a little bit tired because I got up quite early to, this morning to watch the hockey at the Commonwealth Games between Australia and India. And um, yeah, I know it might be a bit of a sore point, but um, Australia won on a penalty shootout. Uh, but then it's one all because India knocked out Australia in the in the Olympics. So uh, we'll see how the final goes. So I wish you a, a great festivity. Enjoy the the, the evening. I'm going to try and do. As good a job, or well, maybe a little bit better than the Premier, which I probably won't. So, Matuja Salam. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs>